everybody, this is Ali Neander speaking to you from Guitar Point, Strictly Mittage Guitars in Maintal, Germany, and today yet another episode of our little series, The Unsung Heroes of Vintage Guitars. This time, the I have to read it myself, 1970 Gibson Les Paul Professional. Well, we might have seen this on photograph, we might have read about it, but have we heard one? No, we haven't. I, I haven't. Well, actually, this is one of the later uh, takes on the Les Paul model. It's a little larger than the Les Paul recording that you might have seen, and it has some really interesting gizmo switches that uh, Les Paul, of course, was very famous for. One is a kind of an impedance uh, switch. <laughs> gives the guitar kind of an acoustic thing, you know. Uh, you probably have heard some of the piezo tr uh, tr uh, uh, bridges for electric guitars and without having that it has this kind of transparency and this kind of acoustic feel so it's probably you can use it very good for clean sounds and for rhythm stuff. But as you've heard it also cuts through when you use it with uh, distortion pedals and so on so it's kind of an interesting thing. It's, it, it's more of a I wouldn't say like a stratish, but you know, it's no comparison actually. But it's it's different from your normal humbucker, but it's really interesting because it, in a way it also rocks, you know, it's, it's, it's not like it's thin. <laughs> I think you can also play it with a high gain amplifier and it probably would, you know, be pretty cool with it. Professional 1970 from Guitar Point in Maintal, Germany. Bye bye.